So guys, I am at the Cuba City here at Lander, Victoria. From here, I will take the bus to go. So from here, I will take the train to go Barbican. And from there, it's just 0 0.6 miles. Uh, I will take this to go there, and it will take around uh, 20 minutes. Let's go. Guys, remember Purani Delhi Railway Station is just like that. So this is Barbican Station at the London, UK. So guys, finally I have reached to the Indian Embassy here. Uh, it was really confusing, seriously. I'm from Delhi, uh, but the network is still understandable, you can understand. But here is really, really strange. So I was asking from the people how to reach to the Barbican station. So from the Barbican station is not too far, it's only uh, 0 0.4 miles from there. And uh, it took me only uh, and say 7 minutes to just reach here from there. So uh, my appointment I have fixed. Now it's, uh, I have still have one hour, but I'm here early. I don't want to take any risk. Uh, now I will see the process. Uh, I saw some videos on YouTube. They were really, really nice. I give the information and uh, I will tell you now what is the process to take the police train certificate from here how you can apply uh, for this you need to basically uh, book the appointment first okay register then appointment after the appointment you need to come here uh, on your book timing after that uh, let's see what is the process I heard that they will give the form to fill up and uh, after that they will charge around uh, 40 to 45 pounds um, by the card only, no cash. Okay, so I'm here and uh, there are many people those who are standing in a queue. So let's stand and wait. Guys, so finally I have completed the PCC process and uh, have submitted to the documents. So one thing I want to mention that I have experienced here, there, uh, they will give you the form to fill, uh, declaration form and another form you need to fill your entire details. Now what are the documents they require? They require your uh, pass, the copy of your passport, your the copy of your BRP and if you are married, uh, so actually if your wife's name is already mentioned on your passport then you don't require the photocopy you know, of your uh, marriage certificate otherwise you required and uh, apart from that uh, you required the current your tenancy agreement alright so if you are living somewhere in the UK you need to take that agreement with you uh, it can be current it can be uh, last three months so, so they asked me my agreement so I give them after that uh, what else I think these are the, the document that you need to take. Uh, take the original BRP card and uh, passport with you. Okay, they want to see that. Uh, I think, yes, these are the things that they ask. Uh, not more. So make sure, huh, for while uh, filling the form, the most important thing, uh, they will ask you the two references. Okay, so if you are coming from uh, you know india here take the contact number of your neighbors uh, ask them the full name and the complete address so while writing while is suppose if you are in the uk and you want to go to for pcc so first call to your parents ask them and the neighbor contact number uh, full name and the complete address that you need to mention in your document here okay they will give you the form you need to mention completely this these details and uh, after that that's it so when i was there i don't have you know the full name of my neighbors uh, the contact number or the address i know but so so i just called my father from there and uh, you know he has to run completely to collect all the documents all the things so 
who better if you are here if you are planning to go to 4 pcc just take the details of your neighbors with you your passport copy original vrp copy original your current tenancy agreement that's it all right and uh, you should know uh, about your police station also so, uh, so i live in delhi so they asked me the district in which district i am living there and the police stations okay so you need to you should know which police station comes means uh, in your area the name of the police station uh, the district you should know these details you need to fill completely in due form and if you need any other details <coughs> how to fill the you know uh, in the form and how to register for pcc how to book the appointment so you can ask me i will uh, give the link into the description and uh, you can just go there click on the first link to book to register yourself first and another after that you need to uh, take the appointment as well so make sure you book everything your bus and everything and there should be a distance within that so my appointment timing was uh, 11:30 and uh, i finished around 1:30 so you need to go according to that and right now i'm waiting at the victoria cow station for my bus and going back to sonzi so as i mentioned in my video that uh, flex bus they charge only 6 pounds so instead of taking the uh, national coach buses because they will charge around 15 pounds to you and uh, if you are student you can uh, get discount of 15 uh, percent if you are using the uni days app All right so either you can choose national or the flex bus i observe national is more uh, the flex bus are more fast and uh, more convenient so i choosing that more cheaper as well see ya